and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. Hi folks, I'm Bob Shrub, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. Yeah, we have the most famous physical therapist on the internet. In our opinion, of course, Bob. Stuck in our secret bunker. Nobody knows the location. <laughs> we're doing our filming here. By the way, we're going to... Um, we're going to start with this title. No. Oh. Uh, best at home, 10-minute body weight, head-to-toe workout. All right. Brad's going to do the working out because we don't have enough space for both of us to do this. Uh, before we do that, if you're new to our channel, please take a second to subscribe to us. We provide videos how to stay healthy, fit, pain-free, and we upload every day. Also, if you get the chance, go to bobandbrad.com because we're always giving something away. Not sure what it is going to be. I don't know if this is Saturday or Sunday or what day this is going to be. Um <laughs> When this goes up, I know what day it is right now. You'll also find it on Facebook, the contest. It's always pinned to the top of the page. If you want a short version of us, go to Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok. TikTok. 60 seconds of Bob and Brad Day. All right, Bob, are you ready? Yeah, you want to jump right into it? Let's get going. All right, let's go. All right, so, you know, in these days when we're confined to a certain area inside, it's not nice out. We want to get some movement because motion is lotion. In other words, it's good for the body, good for the mind. And we got to breathe to get some oxygen, warm up, take a deep breath. In your nose, fill up those lungs and exhale out your mouth. I gotta say, Brad, you look like a natural out there. I could see you on TV. <sighs> oh, yeah, I can see myself on TV. <laughs> One more time, three is good enough, isn't yeah. it? Three is Breathing always strong. is really important. And we'll start with some jumping jacks. Oh, Bob, I'm feeling Help strong express. like bull today. Yeah, strong like bull. This will take about 10 minutes. It'll vary depending on how fast you go, but we're gonna go about 10 minutes. And now, knee circles, take the right knee, go up and around and make a circle with that one and then make a circle with the other one. This is a nice one. I like doing this one for my hips. And you may little... not know, Brad is a, used to be a karate instructor. So yeah. this is probably one you did back then, I imagine. Oh, uh, yeah, something like this. So we'll alter it a little bit, put a kick in there. All right, now let's go to trunk rotations. Great. These are our warm-up warm exercises. And... You can get that whole body and ready to go. Arm circles. You, know, you can start small like this. It's like you're drawing circles on the wall and then bigger circles. And then the other direction. I was going to say, I got both ways. Big ones. <laughs> and then Bob's favorite, the old Alleluia stretch. Yeah. Everything is going to be all right. We're going to be fine in the world. Life <laughs> will go on. All right. I'm well, we're jealous. ready to go. Down, Bob. Down right, with down, the camera. Down we go. Absolutely. All right. Right hand, left shoulder, left hand to right shoulder. Shoulder taps. And four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, and nine, and ten. Push-ups. Try and do some nice good ones. Head up, body straight. You can always do the knee push-ups. Perfectly acceptable. We all have our abilities, and we're going to work with them. You really want to keep your trunk straight while you're doing these. The elbows are pointed back while you're doing them. Your shoulder blades are squeezed together to provide you good support. Good. Now, this is a fun one. Arms stay still. Touch up as far as you can. Now, this is a great mobility one for the hips. And in addition, you're getting some cardio along with it. Hey. Nah. Brad's in good shape, Ten, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Push-ups again. A one, a two, a three, You regularly a four, do push-ups, Brad? You a five. Do push uh, whoo, take a little break. Think about your breathing right now. Good posture. When I was in Aikido, we would sit like this, shoulders back, and it would be excellent for breathing. Exhale and a little out. bit of stretching with that, too. Inhale through the nose and exhale out the mouth. One more time. Let things relax. I'm doing them along with you, Brad. Slow down. Everything feels relaxed. Nice and warm. All right. I'm we're going to go to the second spirit. set. Okay. This one, we're going to actually go in a position like this. Wide base. Right hand touches left knee, left to right. And two. And three. And four. 
Hey, and fire. This is fun, Bob. Yeah, by the way, if you want to add some music to it, we don't have it along with it. You go ahead and play your favorite tunes while you're doing these exercises. It makes it a lot easier to go. I could sing a song, Bob. We're going to add. Not, let's not do that. <laughs> add some push ups. If you want to change your push ups, you could put one hand forward and one hand back and do a little change up. Or do it the standard way. You can do it on your knees back to this. Again, it's your workout. Adjust it to fit your body and your Always ability. have good form, though. For, good form yeah, is not this. Yep. No, and, no, 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 no. And not bent up either. <laughs> right. All right. Now, this is one of my favorite ones. I, I don't like planks, but I do like planks with motion. Yep. And Brad has spondylolisthesis, which I never say right, but... Um, <laughs> And he's able to do these, but he doesn't like regular planks. No, if I do a static plank, my back gets sore the next day, and I say bad things, and that's not good. Yeah, this is really good for you. This is, uh, you know, really working on that core strength, which is really great for your back. Oh, this is good. Yes. All right. You're not taking many rests, Brad. No. Well, I got one rest after the mountain climbers. Okay. So hold on. Yeah, Hold on, say, we're almost there. We're almost there. You're going to get a rest. This is fun. Life is good. And relax. Yeah, good form, Brad. <sighs> Take a deep breath in, that good posture. This is one of those things where it's not the worst thing to have if you have a mirror in front of you um, or to the side of you so that you can see what your form looks like when you're doing these things or have, you know, your spouse or your loved one or family member Say, you know, pointing out any flaws that you might de be demonstrating. As long as you're in good terms with them at the time. Right, and, and as long as the person's knowledgeable on what they're looking for. Yes, i just so. trying to throw some humor in there. <laughs> All right, now we're going to go to the third set. All right. You know what I forgot? I forgot to turn the timer on, so I'm not sure what our time is exactly. All right, that's all right. All if, right. If we get knocked off, we'll get knocked off. All like this, strong like bull, right elbow to left knee. This is a fun one. And you know, sometimes they do, you can do a little, jazz it up a little bit. It looks like you're doing a little two step there. Yeah, two and three and one and two. One and two and three and four. Posture squats. There Good go. posture here, wide base, arms up in the air, and down we go, and up. Now, if this, you're going to take this slow, if you want to do some jumps to make it more difficult, you're welcome to. I am not going to. I'm just going to do posture. Again, everything, spots. everything, the cue here is posture, the, cue, the key word, because if you can't do these with good posture, you shouldn't go any deeper. Right. Because if your back starts to round out when you when you go real deep, yeah. yep, then you're not you're going too deep. Go as far as your your back will allow you or your hips will allow you, and still maintaining posture. Okay, good. This is my favorite. This is from my karate days. It's called a horse stance. Out with good posture, shoulders back, feet out wide, and bend the knees, but don't let them go in. Keep them out. And we're just going to throw uppercuts. Oh, so I see. You're riding the horse and throwing uppercuts. Yeah. So gonna uppercut the horse. Yeah. You'll feel your quadriceps working. And da 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 the old, can I sing a song? Is YouTube gonna get mad no, at no, me? No, no, that'll be well, everybody else will be mad at you, but YouTube won't <laughs> care. Good. So I'm twisting my trunk, using my body. I'm just not doing this. Sure. You really need to work the body in with this. Trying to get a little core here again. Yeah, exactly. And yeah, this is functional because if you're gonna hit somebody, you want to you throw your whole body into well, it. Well, of course not, right? <laughs> All right, one. This is the last one. Last one on this set. All right. Good posture. Right leg is going to go out, and we're going to do a lunge and back. Take your time with it. We don't have to go fast. Go as deep as you feel comfortable. If this is all you feel comfortable doing, you're gold. If you're a little more flexible, a little more athletic, see if you can touch your knee to the floor gently. Gently. I know, I know, there's a few of you out there, they want to do this thing. If you want to do that, you can do that. Otherwise, we're going to work. The thing is, you don't do that until you have form. Again, form right. comes before speed. Uh, exactly, Bob. And that's why I'm doing it this way. I get a little sloppy when I do yep. the jumping. And that's the problem. If, if you can't maintain your form throughout, 
you shouldn't be increasing the speed. All right, that's it. All right. Slow down. We're not gonna just finish, we need to breathe. Exhale, good posture. Think about life, think about everything, how good things are. Gratitude. Right, Gra about gratitude. gratitude. Yep, gratitude, <laughs> that's right. Gratitude. That's our new word, right. gratitude. You know, I'm serious, I think about my parents both lived through the Depression, World War II. They told me stories back then. Yeah, that was sacrifice. That was tough. Yeah. This is not easy. It's not tough, but there's yeah. been hard times before. Broke through it. We're going to do it again. Yeah. So again, do your home exercises at least once a day. I'm thinking two times a day if you're stuck home all day. And then you end up with Brad. Strong like bull. There we go. Go outside for a walk, too. All right, thanks.